dear viewers in this session we will have a discussion on the velocity ratio of a common compound belt drive look when the power is transmitted from driver pulley to the follower pulley through a number of pulleys it is called compound belt drive and this is the construction of a compound belt drive this one is pulley 1 this is pulley 2 driven by pulley 1 driver 1 follower pulley 2 is follower and the diameter of the pulley driver pulley is d1 and the diameter of the follower pulley is d2 speed of this driver pulley is n1 speed of the follower pulley is n2 and both the pulleys are connected by a open wheel drive now another pulley is mounted in the same shaft of the follower pulley and let we give this pulley as 3 and this will act as the driver pulley for the final driven or follower pulley four and both these are connected by open belt drive and the diameter of the pulley drive driver pulley is d3 and the speed of the pull driver pulley is n3 the diameter of the follower pulley is d4 and speed of the follower pulley is n4 here power is transmitted from pulley 1 to pulley 4 through pulleys 2 and 3 so it is called the compound belt drive if we view this pulley from the top view we will we will be able to see pulleys 3 and 4 are mounted on the same shaft this is pulley 3 and this is pulley 2 so since both the pulleys are mounted on the same shaft speed of the pulley 2 is equal to speed of pulley 3 now let us give the value d1 as 400 mm diameter of driver 1 d2 diameter of follower as 200 mm d3 as 300 mm d4 as 150 mm and speed of the driver n1 as 100 rpm now let us find the speed n4 of the follower pulley now the velocity ratio between pulley 1 and 2 is written as
for 1 and 2 fully 2 is written as n2 by n1 is equal to d1 by d2 and velocity for velocity ratio for pulley 3 and 4 is written as n4 by n3 is equal to d3 by d4 let us give this equation numbers as 1 and 2 and multiplying 1 and 2 equation 1 and 2 gives n2 by n1 into n4 by n3 is equal to d1 by d2 into d3 by d4 here n2 and n3 gets cancelled as we discussed earlier speed of fully n2 one n2 and n3 are equal as they mounted on the same sat now n4 by n1 is equal to d1 by d2 into d3 by d4 substituting the values in this equation gives speed of the follower fully So the speed of the follower pulley is arrived as 400 rpm. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this knowledge sharing, click like and subscribe to our channel.